I am Sriram from Trichy Robotics. Uh, today I am going to show you a demonstration of a restaurant serving robot. And this is the setup, overall setup, and this is the robot we have designed. First, I'll explain the arena. In this, we have table one, table two, table three, and table four. And this is a kitchen area. So the robot is. This is the position of uh, robot. Initial position. Before that, I'll explain you the application. This is a software application we have developed, and in this application, firstly we tried with two different uh, tables. Uh, this is a master application, which will be in kitchen, and this is a client application. This will be in each and uh, this will be installed in each and every uh, table. And currently, we have designed for two uh, tables. For example, if I am pressing table number two, and it should be here. So, in from table number two, we have some items, and the customer will order here two, three sets of pongal and four sets of dosa. Okay, and here the total amount will be displayed. And when the customer is confirming the order, uh, here in kitchen, the master will receive the message. Table number two, whatever the client sent from the table, it will be displayed in the master application. That is a number of at least two, three, and four. And after understanding, after receiving the message, the master will cook, and they will, he will be placing placing the content in the robot, and they will be pressing the button, which is back side of the robot. Accordingly, the robot will move, and it will serve, and it will return back to the kitchen. So, in meanwhile, uh, from the client side, if the order is delayed or not received, if they are giving some command. It will give some apologies to uh, client and also in master application, he will be receiving the uh, notification that table number two is getting delayed in from kitchen area. So once they receive the order, they'll command like order received, and after that it will quit. So similarly. This application will work for table one, two, three, and four, and as many as possible. So now, I'll show you the demonstration. Let me show you the demonstration of this restaurant serving robot. Uh, I have placed some food over the uh, robot. Back side of the robot, we have four switches. These four switches represents the table number one, two, three, and four. Uh, from the kitchen area, after placing the food over the robot. The master is expected to press any of the switch. So now I am going to press number two, and we are expecting the robot to serve to the table number two and return back to the kitchen again. So uh, the robot is waiting for the customer to take take the plate from his hand. And once we taken, the robot sends the plate, and it will reach the kitchen area. And it will stop to the kitchen again. And the master will again place another food. And I'm now going to press number table number three, and again I'm going to expect the robot to serve to the table number three and return back to the kitchen again. And again it is waiting for the customer to take the plate. 
from his hand. So this is the demonstration. Thanks for watching.